previously on the 10th. Maybe right. And bam! And hit Timmy's bank and another location. Really Lance Lush now is dominating the Friday scene. You know, Mom, I miss you. Did you go to Brandon, Manitoba? It's time for my own opinion. Hi guys, welcome to my own opinion. And in this video series, I take a beer, I drink it, I tell you what I think about it, in my own opinion. Um, of course, I want you guys to try out all the beers that you can to develop your own opinion on various beers. And today I'm kind of in the mood to drink something cold. Maybe ice cold. Well, here it is. All right, stop. Collaborate and listen. I sit back with my brand new invention. Something grabs a hold of me tightly. Flow like a harpoon daily and nightly. Will it ever stop? Yes, guys, we are drinking Boxer Ice from the Minhas Craft Brewery in Monroe, Wisconsin. Uh, you know, it is a beer champion. Uh, this is a premium lager. Uh, got a 750 milliliter can or 1.8 fluid ounces or 24 fluid ounces. Depending on what country you're from, that will make sense. Um, that's 5.5 percent and yeah so uh let's try let's give this beer a shot i've done so many takes on that intro it's not even funny here we go that's it we're drinking it pouring this into my nonic pint glass and i'll tell you guys it's ice cold i just uh just pulled it out of the fridge i should put it back in after i was filming the intro but anyway let me see here we've got A very clear, well, there was a little bit of head on it, but not very much. Um, lager. It's, it's uh, yeah, it's cold, it's condensations all over the glass right now, but that's because it's ice cold. I mean, I don't drink my stuff warm, you guys know this, but uh, yeah, a little bit of bubbles coming up the side and inside. Actually, it looks pretty nice. But anyway, head's faded already, it's already gone. But let's take a sip. Actually, before I take a sip, yeah, it just smells like a regular lager. Uh, but it's supposed to be a premium lager, and it's ice. So let's try this. Cheers. It's a lager. I mean, it tastes like every other lager does. It's nice. Um... It's just a regular lager. I mean, there's nothing to this. Um, it's a little bit heavy in my in my opinion, and it's nothing nothing to write home about. Am I a fan of it? I guess. I mean, in my opinion, it's a drinkable beer. There's nothing really much going on with it. Carbonation's pretty good still. You know, there is no head in this uh, in this beer, but you know what? It's not bad, and in my opinion, uh, you know what, I would probably buy this again if I could find it here, but can't. I got this, uh, <laughs> actually Nick left this before he went back after the Albino Rhino Beer Festival. So God knows how old this can is. Yeah, there's some numbers on there. Joe would know what that means. But uh, anyway, in my opinion, I like it. It's nice, and uh, guys, like before, you know what, try all kinds of beers. You never know what you like. I like this. It's not the greatest lager in the world, but I mean, it's drinkable, it's refreshing. What else do you want to say? Yeah, there's not much more to say on that one, guys. Uh, you know what, I'm probably going to drink this uh, off camera, because it is a pretty big can there, 750 mils. But anyway, guys, you know what, if you liked the video, click like down below. And don't forget to subscribe, too, on the 10th. And I will catch you guys later. And that was my own opinion. See you guys, bye.